Okay, so today is Sunday, November 14th, and I just woke up a little while ago, so I still look, I look a little crazy, but I am going to take a test today. Um, I want to do it right now before my husband gets home because he went to run a couple errands this morning, so I want to do it before he gets back, um, just because I, if I am, I kind of want to be a surprise um i still think i'm not but i did start having a little bit of symptoms like i've been more emotional lately um headaches um i had really bad nausea last night but that could have been probably i ate something that wasn't agreeing with my stomach <laughs> um so that could have been that but i just also felt i've been feeling more tired lately um headaches emotional and yeah i don't know i just want to take it to get any doubt out of my mind and know for sure um i'm 9 dpo today and my period should be here in five days so i'm gonna take a first response Okay, the test is going and that's also my last test that I have, my last first response. So if it's negative, uh, I don't think I'm going to take another one. I think I'm just going to wait until like, I get my period or um, miss my period. Um, so I guess we'll see. I'll see you guys in three minutes. I'm back and it's been three minutes so I'm about to look at the test. Here we go. Yeah, there's nothing. Wait. I think I see, I think I see a faint second line. But it's like super faint. Oh my gosh, my heart is pounding. Hold on. Guys, there's definitely a second line. And it's really, really, really faint. But I see it. I don't think you're gonna see it, but it's super super faint my hands are shaking definitely looks like a second line i just i don't know how to feel right now i'm confused and i'm shocked and i'm shaking and i i just don't know like i think i'm gonna have to wait a couple of days and take another test um, but that means I'm going to have to buy more because I don't have any more tests left. I, I only have a clear blue left, but I don't really like clear blue. I prefer first response just because I think first response is more sensitive. Um, but yeah, uh, I don't have any more tests, so I'm going to wait a couple of days. I'm 10 DPO tomorrow, so I'll probably wait until 11 or 12 DPO and take another one. But I definitely see a faint, 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 faint second line. I don't know. I don't know because I'm kind of scared because that's how it was with my last pregnancy, which was a chemical pregnancy. It was just really light at first like this. And then it didn't progress. So I don't know. I'll see you guys the next time I take a test. It's now the next day and it's November 15th. I am 10 DPO now and I decided I'm gonna take another test just because I'm super curious and I already have um, some new tests that I bought from, I bought some new first response test. So I decided that today I'm gonna take the clear blue test, the last clear blue test that I have. 
um just because i'm curious and i feel like maybe yesterday was just an evap line i actually posted the test on one of those anonymous um mom forums where you know you ask people if they see the line and stuff somebody commented that it was probably um an evaporation line that it looked like one um so my hopes are kind of <laughs> um they kind of went down a little bit so i'm gonna take this clear blue and see what it says if the clear blue is negative i'm probably gonna wait until like the end of the week to take a first response if i don't get my period um my period is due to be here in four days this one says the results are ready in one to three minutes because it's the fast and accurate one but it is early detection it says it's uh results five days sooner so um i'm probably gonna wait like two minutes okay i'm back and it's been three minutes i put the time for three minutes and it just ended so here we go yeah it's negative I don't see anything on this one. It looks like a pretty clear negative. I'm guessing the line on yesterday's test was probably just an evap line. I'm going to probably wait now until the end of the week and see if I get my period or not. And if I don't, then I will take a first response, which I already have. I bought like a new box so it's looking like a negative i don't see any like faint line or anything on this one i guess it's negative like i thought originally <laughs> i just had gotten my hopes up again and then now it's like disappointment again uh, i will keep you guys updated if i take another one or if i get my period um this week so yeah that's it I decided to look at my clear blue test that i took this morning and i know it's past the time frame but you guys there's a line on there now that wasn't on there before and i'm so confused and i don't know what to think uh it's invalid right but there's literally a line on there now that wasn't on there before this it wasn't on there this morning when i took it and now there's a line I'm shaking, but here's the test. Do you guys see that? It's clearly a second line on there now. I don't know what to think.